Hello, hello, it's Minori Gamers. It's me, Silly Ling, back on to another video for you guys. So I got a great suggestion from Evan. So first and foremost, I want to say thank you, Evan, for giving me this great suggestion about the new event that we have going on, the quiz event. So he suggested I make a video about me taking the quiz and uploading it for everyone out there to see. So I have plenty of accounts. I have 10 accounts, so I'm going to do a video for each of the quiz and there is a quiz on monsters rune battle guild and other so i can do about um a hundred plus quiz questions but since there's only five and ten questions each i don't need to do all 100 of them so i don't really know the answers myself i'm going to try the best as possible so bear with me and hopefully i will give you guys the right answers <laughs> if i get them wrong and you get you can get them right. So, this is account number one that I'm on. I have 16 available quiz questions. And I will start off with the monster quiz. So, question number one. When using Water Phoenix as a leader in scenarios will increase the HP of ally monsters by 44%. Uh, for Water Phoenix... Let's see, I have my other devices open so I can take a look right now. Um, it says increases the HP of ally monsters in dungeon by 44%. So this is increase HP of ally monster by 44%. So I'm gonna say false. And yay, that's the correct answer. Next question is water, um, werewolf can be found in a secret dungeon. That is true. Cool, two for two. Next question is, when Joker amp amputation magic inflicts damage that ignores defense. So let me just look up the water Joker. And it says, inflicts damage that in ignores defense. And it says right here, I'm looking at his... Um, Wind Joker Amputation Magic inflicts damage that ignores defense. Bear with me guys, I am looking up on my other device about his skills. Doing a sharp text. So I think it's Inflicts damage that ignores defense. I believe that's true. Yay! That's, that is true. Cool. Next question. You can level up skills of a dark vampire lord by using vampires as of any attribute. Sorry. <laughs> uh, let's say it's true. Yay! Cool. Next question. Oopsie. Clicked on the wrong button. Sorry. So this is a question, I believe, from Battles. Okay. So in Kairos Dungeon Dragon Lair B10... Okay, Dragon Lair B10. Let me just go look at that real quick. Dungeon boss battle, the immunity crystals removes harmful effects granted on the boss and grants immunity for three turns. So, let's look up the dragon's info. I am looking it up in Kairos Dungeon strategy info. Boss, and then you click on the floor, B10, so it says the immunity crystals remove harmful effects granted on the boss and grants immunity for three turns. So, the immunity crystals, it says remove the harmful effects on the boss and grants immunity for three turns, so this is true. Cool. Alright, back to the monsters. Sorry, I clicked on the wrong one. You can craft a 3 star max level by using 3 three default 3 star monsters at craft building. So let me jump into the craft building real quick. And take a look. Craft building says you can make a 3 star monster. Wouldn't you just do that on the... Oh, you can. Okay, so this is true. Next question, 
You can craft ancient crystals by selecting a default 5 star fusion monster. Oh, fusion monster, that's a keyword. By going to the craft building and special. I don't believe you can use fusion monsters, so I'm going to say false. So you have to use um, regular default 5 star monsters. Next question is, you can place him monkos a port, sorry, attack and support that that's available to craft from craft building homunculus in arena defense team. I believe this is true. Nope, it's false. So that one is false. Um, next question is, you can level up skills of a second awakened Nagumi by using a unawakened Nagumi. No, you cannot. So that's false. You have to use double ones once they are second awakened. Or using another awakened Nagumi to awaken to level up the Nagumi. Um next question is you can level up the skills of a light fairy queen by using berries. This is true. And this one is light Nagumi is not available from light and darkness scrolls. It's not available from it. I don't think so. I think you can get them from there still. So I think this is Akumi is not available. I think this is false. Yep. Next question. You can place the homunculus attack support that's available from craft room in the arena defense. And this is true. Oopsie. Sorry. <laughs> false. There we go. So that is all 10 questions for the monsters. Um quiz and as you guys notice that even if you mess up you will get the same question afterwards so this is once again the monster quiz and i'm going to jump onto another account to do the next quiz which will be about runes so be right back guys or actually i can try to do the last three right now in scenario battles the rune number dropped from stages 1 to 6 matches the stage number. I believe this is true. Next question is, you can convert only one sub property in one rune by using enchanted gem. True. Cool. Next question, when crafting low, mid, high runes at craft building runes, you can select the type of runes. However, the number of sub properties will be random. True. Yay. Cool. So, yeah, be right back. I'm going to go on to another account so I can do all 10 questions of the room quiz all at once. So, be right back, guys. <laughs> 